shrugging the trainers away. And the drop punt kick goes into the pocket. Madden can't mark. Gow kicks it away. Cameron and Hannah. Siren will go any minute now. Cameron pushes it over. And it will go right now. And Footscray supporters are ecstatic. They have told and goalless after three quarters. Well, Carlton, nine behinds, an amazing scoreline. We've been digging through the record books and we find the last time Carlton failed to score a goal in a league match was 1902. Well, can they break that drought? We pick up the action at the start of the final term. Start of the final term in the Western Oval. Footscray going to the left of screen. Carlton without a goal in 90 minutes of football. James on the bottom of the pack. Punched away by Gow. Dean able to straighten up and kick the ball to half forward. Foster got his hands on it, had a very good third quarter. Liberatore on the bottom of another pack, O'Sullivan. Foster, Phillips, Wine, who's been very good. So's Atkins, been so many good Footscray players. Baxter with courage again. He did something in the third quarter that was amazing with his courage. And that one there, he had to sit and wait. He's done the job on Bradley very well today. Or strength by Atkins, a very good handball to Coleman. Footscray into the breeze, attacking. Grant with a chance to juggle. A quick kick away by Alvin. And Justin Madden takes the mark and handballs to Phillips across to Gleeson. Gleeson's further hand pass finds Michael James. James with one tap on the ground. He's run about 20 metres. Second tap on the ground. Then the left foot kick towards centre half board. Mick Connell now. Beaten for it by Eppleston. Tap over to Darui. Darui's kicked a goal. No, he hasn't. Oh, God forbid. Getting <laughs> excited, Robert. Oh, it really was, Bertie. <laughs> I swallowed the pencil. Ten points. Well, at least they've been at their lowest score ever. That was way back in 1898 when they kicked six behinds against Collingwood. You've just spent 15 minutes trying to find that. Well done. And uh, I can safely say none of this trio was there that day. Liberatore. Who's played superbly as you'd expect in the conditions? Coleman, who's been a winner on the, all the opponents he's been on today. Phil Cracker. Clever. Sexton and David Kernahan. Still Sexton. Cracker. And that one. Hannah marks out on the fall anyway. So touched off the boot, surely. Hannah Short, Phillips, at half-back. He has had a lot of kicks, but uh, Liberatore probably the best of the small men. Cameron's been terrific. Tackled by Stephen Kernahan. Cameron, one of three 18-year-olds playing with this team for Footscray today. But they've all made a contribution. Boundary throw in, set a wing in front of the member stand. Madden tries to tap it down. Kick off the ground is by Gow. Desperate stuff by Dean. Equally desperate stuff by Liberatore. I think Robbo Carlton would have given up any hope of winning the match now. Would you think to try to kick a goal, Bernie? I think the main interest I was going to say would be if they could kick a goal for the day. Yeah, you're loving this, aren't you? Never mind. Let's get on with the footy. Leon Cameron. Oh, good gather. Gee, skillful. Oh, wonderful kick. He's uh, equally as good on the left as he is on the right, Leon Cameron. Crackers kick to the goal front. Oh, has Charles got his foot good before Silvani has? And oh, that could be a free kick against Justin Charles. And he was a little excited there. It should be a long time since the side's uh, been kept goalless in a match, Rob, I would think. I haven't got the record in front of me, but certainly would be a long, many years. Elvin's kick finds Hannah. Hannah on centre wing, goes for the torpedo punt kick. Up to half forward, no mark taken. Now a chance for Meldrum. Kicks it up to the goal front. Ah, Siri can't mark. He's, he's being kick. held. Yep, being held by McPherson. Inside a minute, Mark Ah Siri is uh, about 35 metres. I might have spoke a bit soon there, Robbo. No, it would be testing kick, I think, for Ah Siri. He's got to kick it long, but he's got to kick it accurately. Oh, he kick. does it both. He does it both. 
And well done, Matasu. So Carlton's first goal comes in the last 35 seconds of the game here at the Western Oval. And Steve McPherson, gee, you're a lousy bloke. He was dirty on Mark Arsiri getting that goal.